children need to discover their own strengths and weaknesses in order to find fulfillment as adults in both work and play. Watching television does not lead to these discoveries, it only limits children's involvement in those real-life activities that might offer their abilities a genuine testing ground. And young children's need for fantasy is gratified far better by their own make-believe activities than by the adult-made fantasies they are offered on television. The numbers on U.S. student debt, after all, are truly staggering. The average 2015 U.S. university graduate who took out loans to help pay for tuition enters the workforce with $35,000 in student debt. The numbers on U.S. Ever since I remembered, my father woke up at 5.30 every morning, made us all breakfast, and read the newspaper. After that, he would go to work. He worked as a writer. It was a long time before I realized he did this for a living. Ever since I remember. In the fast changing world of modern healthcare, the job of a doctor is more and more like the job of a chief executive. The people who run hospitals and physicians' practices don't just need to know medicine, they must also be able to balance budgets, motivate a large and diverse staff, and make difficult marketing and legal decisions. Introvert, or those of us with introverted tendencies, tends to recharge by spending time alone. They lose energy from being around people for long periods of time, particularly large crowds. Extroverts, on the other hand, gain energy from other people. Extroverts actually find their energy is sapped when they spend too much time alone. They recharge by being social. Introverts. 